What's going on everybody? Today I'm going to be showing you guys the filming locations to John Krasinski's Quiet Place. The first location I'm going to be taking you guys is this uh, little marketplace on Main Street in Beacon, New York, where they filmed the opening scene. Let's do it. And here we are, Beacon Natural Market. All of the interior shots in the beginning of the movie were filmed right inside that marketplace with the exception of them exiting the marketplace. That was actually filmed on a location in Little Falls, New York. And uh, the owners of Beacon Natural Market were nice enough to let me come in and take photos and video. So I'm gonna do that for you right now. Let's check it out. This aisle right here was used in the movie. You can tell because you have that fixture right in the middle and that pole leading right to the left of it. Looks a lot different when the lights are on and there's food on the shelves. This shot was really easy to find. All the produce shelves match perfectly to the way they did in the movie. And right here on the floor you would have seen leaves and that shopping cart flipped over. Would have been right in, right in there. We would have seen Krasinski's daughter run right across here. Reagan would have tiptoed along here and ran right down this aisle. Emily Blunt would have been walking towards me and you would have seen that fridge door wide open. She would have walked alongside this freezer. And right here, there would have been a rack full of Doritos, which clearly isn't here today. That was just a prop for the movie. This section right here was used as the pharmacy in the movie. As you can see, it is still a pharmacy to this day. However, for the movie, they built a counter right along here. And you can also see a shelf leaning up against the side of this fridge, along with the words pharmacy written right across the top. This right here is a shelf where we see little Marcus reaching for his toy rocket ship. The rocket ship would have been sitting somewhere right around here on this, on this row. I know this is the right shelf because the owner of the store directed me to this location, so that all happened right here. As soon as they leave the store, they venture off into the woods across this bridge right here where unfortunately baby Bo gets snatched up by the creatures, but we won't talk about that. It's still an iconic shot and an iconic scene from the movie. But would have been standing somewhere in this general area right here when that rocket ship went off and, well, you know. I'm walking back to my car now, but let's just get one last shot of this bridge. Beautiful. But yeah, the cast would have been on the rail trail walking towards me this way. And right about where I'm standing right now, is about the spot where John and Emily turn around because that spaceship turned on. Such a shame. And finally, we have the Quiet Place house. That's a nice house.
All of the interior shots in the movie were filmed inside of this house. I wish I could get, I wish I could go in or at least get a little closer, but this is private property. Somebody currently owns the house, so I will respect that and stay back here. But just being here, it's an eerie feeling. In addition to the house, the barn directly across the street. The barn's over a hundred years old, but they built an extension on it specifically for the movie. I don't know which one's the original and which one's the extension on it, but it's one of those. The people that own this property are actually pumpkin farmers. And when they were approached to have the movie shot here, Krasinski's like, dude, I need corn. The farmers were like, dude, we got pumpkins. Krasinski's like, dude, that is sick, but I really need some corn. So the farmers agreed and they actually spent months planting over 20 tons of corn across this field behind me. All right, well, I'm gonna get going now because I've been chilling on the side of the road and I've almost been hit by about 10 cars. My life is in jeopardy, so I'm gonna get out of here. But one last look at the house and the barn. So cool. And that concludes my video. Special thank you to the owners and staff at Beacon Natural Market for allowing me to come in and take photos and videos. You guys were super cool and super helpful. I greatly appreciate that. I'd like to thank the owner of the store, Katie, for pointing out all the spots in the store where they filmed the movie. You were super helpful and super nice. I greatly appreciate it. And it was a pleasure talking to you about the making of the movie. It was really interesting hearing it from someone who was there while the filming occurred. That was awesome. Thank you.